All right, the big foldable launch of the year has just happened. This is the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6, just launched at the Galaxy Unpacked 2024, right here in Paris. And I have the exclusive hands-on look of this phone from the Unpacked event. This one right here is, of course, the new color that Samsung has introduced on its uh, foldable phone, the pink one. And this is not usually a color that you associate with a foldable phone. So let me know what your thoughts on this particular color. But in case you don't like it, there are other colors as well. There is a dark blue color. There's a gray color of this uh, very same phone. I'm not sure how many of these colors will eventually make it to the Indian market. But these look very, very classy. Of course, this premium uh, titanium frame, which is on the sides very nice glass finish on the back very subtle understated sort of a design not too many changes from the design point of view still looks very similar to last year's galaxy z fold uh, 5 in fact the cover screen has also not been increased so much this year maybe there was not so much scope for that as well on the front this is what the phone looks like but there are some interesting changes inside the phone you now get the snapdragon 8 gen 3 chipset as expected which makes it the, one of the most powerful foldable phones in the market out there so you expect really good CPU and GPU performance but it also means there's an integrated NPU which means the Galaxy Z Fold 6 is also an AI ready device and that's the big story here because Samsung is bringing a lot of its Galaxy AI experiences on this very phone so you get all your usual AI features like magic eraser image expansion but you also get a notes assist feature so in the notes app you now get AI which can summarize and sort of sort those notes out for you the same also extend to the PDF file so if you have a long PDF file this AI basically can summarize it for you and give you a quick summary of those long PDF notes there is transcript assist browsing assist so if you are going through a page on the internet you can basically transcribe it translate it all those uh, functionalities are available on this phone now the circle to search feature which made a lot of headlines earlier this year is also coming on the galaxy z fold 6 no surprises over there so any image that you see any object that you see you click an image you tap on it and google results will be there on your screen instantly Apart from these, there is also an instant live translation feature which is coming on this phone. So these are all the AI features that are coming to the Galaxy Z Fold 6. But what Samsung is saying this year, the focus is on an AI ecosystem. So not just it is bringing the AI on this particular phone, but also on other devices like the Samsung Galaxy Watches, its new Galaxy Ring, Buds, and together they will give you a more AI driven experience, what it means, how it works. We'll have to wait and figure that out to see how effective it is in real world scenario but uh, this is what the galaxy z fold 6 looks like it's of course lighter than earlier 14 grams lighter than the galaxy z fold 5 the weight is now at 239 grams which is i think the same as the recently launched vivo x fold 3 pro which was claimed to be the lightest uh, foldable phone in the market and this also thinner than before and to complement all of this hardware you're also getting seven years of os and security updates on the galaxy z fold 6 so this sort of completes the overall experience right here. Let me know what are your thoughts on the Z Fold 6. Of course, there's not like a lot of hardware changes on this particular phone, but the software is what, are, what is going to drive your overall Galaxy experience.